What is going on guys? It's Courtney and today's video I'm gonna go over a few plugins that Loot Audio was kind enough to donate to me. The first plugin on the list is Obelisk. Essentially what it does is build chords for you and it has a set of chords that you can use and you're able to change the key and the scale within this plugin as well as add other chords into the mix. And the way that you're gonna add this to your production is by creating a new track, going to MIDI effects, going down to audio units, it's by Frozen Plane, and then you're just going to click on Obelisk, and then you will add your instrument from there, and it will build the chords. So let me show you what I mean. I'm gonna pull up the musical typing keyboard so you can see what notes I'm hitting, as well as see what chords are being played on Obelisk. So let's go. So that is D major. So if we want to change it to E minor. If you don't want it to be a seventh chord, take that off. So now let's try F and actually let's do the jazz scale. And let's add a seventh back into the mix with this jazz. Let's see what it sounds like on a different sound. Now let's try it on an appreciated sound. So there you have it. That is plugin number one. Now moving on to plugin number two. It's called Glitchy and it's a percussive based instrument where you can add textures and layers to your productions. So let's check it out. We click the randomize button right here. It will give us a percussive loop and you can just play it by hitting the play button right here. Now, if we hit the time button, it will change the time that this percussive loop plays. So like this. And as well as hit the randomizer button, you can create your own little loops by clicking in these cells. And this is what it sounds like. Essentially, you'll be able to use this for textures and ambient layers, like I said before. It's a cool little plugin to add just a little bit of spice to your productions. Now on to plugin number three. This one is called Digital Love Child, and it is a plugin that you use inside of Contact. I don't know if I mentioned this before, but Glitchy is also a plugin that you use inside of Native Instruments Contact. So, with that being said, let's check it out. So there are a few sounds, but let's add the Obelisk plugin to this so we can see some nice chord textures.
to plug in number four. This one is called Bombay Glassware and it essentially sounds like you're hitting glass. So let me show you what I mean. All right, within this plugin, you can add some attack, release, feedback or delay. I'll show you what I mean. Or we could add more reverb. We could reverse the reverb. We can add a sequencer. I want to shout out Loot Audio again for sending these over to me. And now here's a beat that I made using all of these plugins plus a sample pack that they sent over as well. So let's go. <laughs> That is just a little spice of 2019 if you haven't already hit the subscribe button as well as that little bell so you get a notification every single time i post i will catch you guys in the next video peace out and there we are hope you enjoyed that banger